All right, so check it out. New burger alert over at uh, Culver's. Right here, we have the bag. Culver's has come out with a brand new Smokehouse Barbecue Cheddar Pub Burger, complete with a cheddar bun. You heard that correctly. It's in this box right here. I'm in a deluxe state of mind. Not today. Today, it's all about the Smokehouse Barbecue. We're going to check it out. Cue the intro. What is up everyone? It is the endorsement and it is time for another review. This is where I try something and tell you if you should like it or not. I could be very persuasive. Let's go Smokehouse Barbecue Cheddar Pub Burger, uh, a sweet and tangy barbecue sauce, cheddar cheese, crispy onion rings, pickles, and signature mayo all on a cheddar bun. That is correct. I already took this out to film the thumbnail and this cheddar bun smelled amazing and was one of the softest buns I have touched in a while. So here we go. Let's get you the first look at it. Check it out right there. There you go. There's a pickle right there coming up. You see it? Do you see it? The barbecue sauce. This bun is so fluffy. Where is the onion rings? Oh. That's an interesting build. Onion rings on the bottom. Onion rings on the bottom alert. <laughs> I don't know why that was funny to me. Let's check it out. All right, so I put it back together. One more look, the Smokehouse Barbecue Pub Burger. There it is. Check it out. Oh, we got a, uh, we got a what is it, an onion ring. I'm trying to escape Shawshank. This bun is so soft. Do you see? pillowy goodness. Reminds me of that steamed bun I just had over at uh, McDonald's. Shout out that video in case you missed it. Let's go. So much barbecue sauce. A lot of flavor, but way too much barbecue sauce. I never think about laying something down on the floor. That hit the floor and just we had a we had a barbecue explosion right there but um flavor on that's on point. Whew. All right so listen um Culver's I'm a fan of Culver's if you have watched the channel enough Culver's usually always delivers and uh, like I've said before since we're talking about Culver's best fast food fish sandwich in the game when it's out the walleye uh, fish sandwich. Let's take a second bite. Mm. It's a lot of meat. All right, so first things first, I love when uh, companies describe something and they deliver. Because this thing, let me tell you, definitely gives me a smokehouse barbecue vibe. Ooh. <laughs> sweating up a storm and this thing isn't even hot uh, and the other thing when they are calling their uh, barbecue sauce sweet and tangy it really is sweet and tangy so that's a good thing in my book I love the addition of the um, onion rings and the pickle always good on a sandwich I'm going in for the final bite right there but this burger meaty very tender not dry in any means and I love it when companies uh, actually call their uh, barbecue sauce something and it delivers because this is sweet with a little bit of uh, barbecue tang so here we go I'm gonna go into for the final bite this is a really good sandwich seven dollars and 19 cents for the double I think it was 579 for the single and maybe nine nine seventy nine I didn't see the price on the menu have to double check uh, close to ten dollars for the triple uh, I went with the double I'm happy with it the mayonnaise kind of gets lost in the mix and I'm a little perplexed as to why the build is this way why the onion rings don't go on top of the burger I'm a fan of that I still got a taste in that second bite, but I would have preferred uh, them up on the top of the burger. But I'm going to go right into that section right there. No mistaking that one right there. And uh, let's go. Dripping all over the place. 
All right, so listen, I am a fan of this Smokehouse Barbecue Cheddar Pub Burger. The last thing I wanna do is try the bun, the cheddar bun by itself right there and see if I do get a flavor of uh, cheese with barbecue sauce. There's no getting away from the barbecue sauce on this burger, but, um, oh, yeah. Yeah, it reminds me a little bit of a uh, Asiago cheese uh, bagel. Yeah, but not Asiago, cheddar. Yeah. I like that, I like the flavor of that. I think it does get uh, kind of lost a little bit with everything going on in the burger. So you're not 100% getting the taste of the cheddar bun with each bite, but I respect the game that they're thinking outside the bun and the fact that it is very fresh. Um, there you go. And I'm pretty sure Kathy Two Cent Chick Fame uh, is going to be uh, filming this uh, the same day I am. She might be getting it out the same day I am because it, it officially launched today, the day you're seeing this later on in the day day do a shot every time i say day so definitely uh look for that over at two cent chick uh and light up the comment section a lot of people over there saying hey two cent chick have you in the endorsement ever dated no she's married has kids we've never dated i don't know it's funny i could be friends with a female uh, youtuber and i could be friends with a male youtuber and i get like 20 times the comments uh asking me about my friendship with the female uh youtuber than the male youtuber I love it. It's funny. We always laugh at those comments, but um, now that I mentioned it, uh, probably more comments are going to be coming out. There you go. We are friends. She is a great person and she supports the channel. I don't mind shouting her out uh, any chance I get. So there you go. Um, another review in the books. No. I got, I got talking about my ex-girlfriend. I didn't give it a rating. Once 100, it is a solid 91. Could have been a little higher, had way too much of the barbecue sauce. I didn't really like the uh, size of the onion rings and they were on the bottom of the uh, burger, but they never miss with the uh, flavor and the uh, juiciness of their burgers over at Culver's. And if you didn't know, it's always fresh to order over at Culver's. You order and they always tell you to pull up and you gotta wait for it. So I respect the game over there. And uh, now, there you go. Another review in the books. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe. Also, please do not forget to check me out on Instagram and Twitter. That is social media, getting the word on my channel out to the masses. In closing, light up the comments. I know what comments are coming. This is a new burger from Culver's. I endorse it. Punch of approval. And um, that's it. We'll see you soon with some more reviews. Bye.